Hello and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts. Chain of Memories. Free Chain of Memories. I, Luigi Van 64D. So recently we went through Monster again, uh, destroyed the Parasite Cage once more, and that's about it. There's a shop. I think we're fine. I'll probably end up changing, rearranging the deck later. Just bits and pieces. Maybe you could try telling us some more stuff about her. Who knows? It might even help you remember other things. Well, uh... She was quiet. And always drawing. When we'd go to the beach, She'd draw a picture instead of swimming. Sometimes she'd draw us, too. She was really good. <laughs> I remember Riku and I fighting over who she'd draw next. But one day, she was gone. Just like that. I think the grown-ups knew the reason. They might even have tried to explain some of it to me. But I was little. I probably didn't understand what was happening. I remember crying after she was gone. But that's all. I still don't remember her name. Oh, I bet you remember it in no time. Ah, I must point out, Sora keeps remembering things instead of forgetting them. It seems to me, forgetting things may be the only way to reach the memories very deeper down inside each of us. So we should forget in order to remember? Like those guys said, our most precious memories lie so deep in our hearts that they're out of reach. All that stuff about finding, being losing, and losing being finding? I didn't get it at first, but maybe this is what they meant. Gorge, Sora. I think I'm a little jealous of you. How come me and Donald and Jiminy aren't remembering more of the stuff from our memories? Come on, Goofy. Let's get going. We gotta forget things faster. Well, at least they've got motivated. Motiva motivation. Still much remembered? Wouldn't take long for her name comes back to you too. Yeah. I have lots of buried memories. Memories to remember. Hmm. I still wonder about that. Well, let's just keep going forward. Just as we intended. We'll continue with our plan. Let's see how far this group will go. You had your fun on the first floor. So this time, it's my turn. <laughs> I'm not going to just give it to him. Don't break him. Well... Do I detect a soft spot? I'm not gonna break the toy. I'm not dumb. Don't forget. Sora is the key. We need him if we're going to take over the organization. I know that you're in on it too. But keep it under your hood. At least until the time is right. You would have been wise to have done the same, Larxene. Not very organized, this organization. Sora, 
So, Sora, did anything back there help you remember your friend's name? Uh, her name's the only thing I can't seem to remember. You gotta try. Hurry up and remember it. <laughs> The thing is, I don't think I have any world... I don't think I have any more world, uh, car cards left. Don't you just hate it when something's on the tip of your tongue? Yeah. That's me, you're this close to remember your friend's name. Yeah. Just need a little bit more, I think. Was there a card left? Am I misremembering? Oh, of course, how could I forget Halloween Town? How could I ever forget that one? Of course, don't like the looks of this place. That's crawling with ghosts. Still, there's nothing to worry about. Don't be spooked if you already know what's coming. I think your real ghosts can frighten us anymore. They're gonna look at us. They'll be the ones to run away. Really think so? Trust me. Hmm. Welcome to Halloween Town. <laughs> that was the best shriek I've heard in ages. If you're that easy to scare, we're gonna have a great time. Sorry, I haven't even introduced myself. I'm Jack Skellington, and this is Halloween Town. People around here call me the Pumpkin King. So if you're looking for a ghoulishly good time, you've come to our right place. We, we're not! Too bad, because at the moment, we've got a bit of a problem in Halloween Town. What kind of problem? Well... Like this! Alright, let's... No problem. Nope. Equally, most of these guys are a pushover. Ooh, ooh, don't like that. Nope. Ooh, Jack. Ooh, two Jack. Alright, surprise level two! Ice, thunder, nice. He's kind of a better version of Donald because he only does, uh. Nope. Ah. He's kind of a better version of Donald because Jack casts the, the level two tier of spells for ice, thunder, I don't think fire? Maybe gravity. We'll have to find out. Hey, yeah, why'd you go and call the Heartless? <laughs> I didn't call them. I just knew when they were going to show up. In fact, I'd love to get rid of them. I actually go around attacking people instead of just scaring them. Why are they here? I was just going to ask Dr. Finkelstein some questions. I'm heading to his laboratory right now. Follow me! Hmm. Well... At least he seems to know where to go. Let's follow him. I don't like this. Always lead us to the Heartless. I don't think so! <laughs> Bingo! He saw right through me! That's so easy. I'm just kidding. Now let's go. They don't call him the Pumpkin King for nothing. Sora learned terror. That's not normally a good thing. Now, to, su to cast terror takes two summon cards and Jack, or if you no longer have Jack in the party, Simba, Mushu, and an item. 
it's very not useful. Ghosts and goblins everywhere. Life's no fun without a good scare. This is not the very first time, but there is no sequel song. Time to fight some, some more fan favorites we got. I really want to know where they thought the idea for that plant. But that's okay. We got my whites, ghosts. Thunder Ray just kind of eviscerates everything, don't worry about it too much. Hey, save part. Save point. But more importantly, it's an eight. And if I do. Whoa. Oh, okay. Caught. Oh. So this layout is actually more aggressive than the other places. As you can tell from the uh, aggressive fountain. One. Tranquil darkness. Let's start easy. Alright. Oh, oh, going up here. What's the map look like? Oh, I have to go up. Uh, one. That's easy. Source is weak. Power up my spells. Ooh, gargoyle. Howdy. I was too close. Honestly, I don't, even, I don't even think I need it, because my spells are already kind of strong. Oh. oh. I need it. I right, get him. There we go. Calm Bounty. Don't mind if I do. Nope, not this way. What do we need? Exactly a three, exactly a four. Well, here's my three. It's exactly a four. That's okay. I, with the roulette card, I could just get more later. I'm going to introduce Dr. Finkelstein. He's a world-famous genius. Yes, maybe I'm too smart. I'm afraid I've created something horrible. Which is? Well, have you ever stopped to think about the power of true memories? True memories? See, my boy, our hearts are full of memories. But not all of them reflect the truth. The heart isn't a recording device. Even important memories change with time. They warp or fade, leaving us with but a shadow of what we hoped to remember. Could that be happening to me? It happens to everyone. Some memories grow ugly and some become more beautiful. If we could recover our true memories, the world would simply... It would seem completely different. I devised a potion from forget-me-nots to bring our true memories back. Did it work? Well, that's the problem. As soon as the doctor got a whiff of that potion, Harley started popping up. Sounds like a failure to me. No! The research is flawless! I just need another look at the potion to find out what went, what, what went wrong. Another look at it? Unfortunately, it vanished. 
Maybe someone swiped it? It must have been Sally. Jack, go fight. You got to find her and get my potion back. Leave it to me. Can I tag along? <laughs> what for? I want to know more about these true memories the doctor keeps talking about. Excellent. Let's go find Sally. True memories. Hmm. What makes them more true than others, I wonder? Well, that's an easy one. Oh, oh, bye-bye. Now we can easily just... Ooh, bench. Nothing in the bench. And can I... Yes, I can. Now with this, we can get another roulette card. Let's see what we need first and foremost. 20! No, wait, no, that's riches. Never mind. I don't need that. Howdy! It's not a guaranteed thing to get. Oh. Oh no. No. Nope. Alright. Now can I get another roulette? Oh, that's a nine. There's no other roulettes, so I'll take the nine. Too close. Nope. Oh. Nope. Yeah, I got the other guy in the back. I got them both. I love using the fire raid and blizzard raid. Uh, none of these have anything. They're all of no value. Wait, is that an eight? Yeah, it's an eight. I'm gonna get that. Eight with the black mushroom room. All right, sounds good. All right. Yeah, having a good time. I don't talk about it often, but I really like how they're animated, how the heartless like meander about. Take you guys out now. Huh. I read five. I'll take it. Still don't need health yet. But I may need axe. Or a heal. I think I need a second heal now. Jimmy don't have a second cloud. Uh Nineteen? That's oh, fifteen. Could be useful. Right, that works. Oh, I want them. I want those moveable points. Health and still need a little bit more. I oh, know I actually have enough red. Oh, that was easy. Can I get another roulette card? No. Okay, I tried. 
I'm gonna move the shop. That works. Alright. Ow. That actually hurt. Pumpkin at him. Dang it. Too far. All right. Freeze. Oh, too close. Hit him in the air? Nope. And you. There we go. Come on, another roulette card. Nope, no roulette. Alright. Well, I'll take a six, Calm Bounty. Alright, that'll do for now. Still not the one I need. Alright. Alright, let's get this calm bounty. Remember, each world has one or two. Let's see, this is... Gifted Miracle. Reload cards to reset the counter while restoring health to Sora and foes alike. So it heals everybody. Using a summon, a magic, and jack, or a Bambi, Blizzard, and an item. I don't think we've seen Bambi yet. Well, let's just gather all the rest of the stuff from here if we can. Ooh, ooh is that pumpkin head? That's our first pumpkin head. And that's our second. Alright. Oh, that is that is cool. I know the whole skyline isn't a lot for this area. But at least they got the hill in here. That that's so good. S seven. Uh I actually don't have anything that high besides this. I'm save I'm gonna save that red nine. Cause that's a high value one. Alright. Yeah. Not normally save in the middle of a dungeon, but you know what? I think it's fine this time. Just in case. Alright, now what? Nope. Oh, wait. Here, take this. 30 green! Uh... I don't have a single green to my name, though. Alright, well, it's time to grind for some greens. Oh, hey. Thanks for volunteering. Jack, Miss Jack. There we go. Oh. Hi. Can I get a high level green? Four, five, nine. In that nine. Alright, I need eleven in green. I had no green. I'll try to use it on the way here. Although that was only like a four. Good. 
Alright, that did it. I guess. Ooh, there's seven. There does not seem to be a roulette card in this world. Hmm. I'm honestly surprised. Because it's, you know... Boogie Boogie does, has a whole uh, roulette wheel. Oh, green! Five! Oh, oh! Ooh, that's enough! Okay, good. Good, 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 good. good. Alright. Um... Oh. Alright. Go up here, then. Oh, that, that stop? Really? Five plus. Nope, still can't do a Moodle shop. Do another call and bounty. Maybe there's a second one not related to Jack. It'd be great if there was. Unless it's gonna be like a pumpkin head. Pumpkin head. Okay. I tried. Ooh, free blizzard. Free blizzard. Nope. Uh-oh. Alright, I need... something seven or higher. That still hit me. Behind? Two. The calm bounty, though. You got some? saving reds for? Like, am I dumb? Reds for this. I just need to save my greens. What am I doing? Right. Looming Darkness. If you remember how Looming Darkness card works. Uh, the Heartless run very fast, so you gotta run. Maybe a big room, but... Mm, they're very aggressive. Exactly six. Exactly seven. There we go. Really use a six. Tombstone's gonna fall on me now. Get the gargoyle with this? Nope. Well, this time. It's a green. Give you a six. Nope, that's two. I'm only getting twos. Freeze. This is it. Right. 
Goofy. Six, but I have to go all the way back to the roulette room. Gotta go all the way back to the roulette room. Did me to double back in there? I just want to see if I could change it. Nope, not into something I have. Exactly six, huh? Wrong room. If there's ever a part of the game I didn't like, it'd be this, where I have to just grind for the right cards. I'm thankful I didn't need too much grinding. But that's not gonna be a six, is it? Nope, that's an eight? Alright. Okay, I guess. Wrong way. You get the wrong way. Alright, now I just need a six. He's a heartless. There's one. We can make this work. Stop my attack. Now can I get a six? Of course, the mobile room is a six. It is a six, but that's the only one I have. That's fine. Alright, let's just zoom back then. Change it from here. Exactly zero. Nope. I tried. Exactly six. Exactly seven. And heave guidance. There you are, Sally. I thought I'd find you here. And who are your friends? <laughs> They're interested in true memories. You have the potion, don't you? Well, yes. Would you give it back? I guess so, if you insist. But, I'm afraid. All the doctor did was smell it and the heartless appeared. What if someone drinks it? Are you kidding? What could be more exciting? I'm worried, Jack. Isn't there another option? Well, any ideas, Jack? I can't think of a thing. I can. <laughs> Give it here. The potion! 
Oogie, you again. <laughs> Jack, where are your manners? I'm just helping you put the potion to good use. You should thank me. <laughs> well, just one sniff and Arliss appeared. What would happen if I chugged the whole thing? That would be scary. Poor Jack. You can't hold a candle to Oogie Boogie. Time for Halloween Town to taste pain and despair beyond any nightmare. Hey, that rhymed. Pain and despair? Oogie, you monster. Come on, Jack. Gotta go after him. I guess Oogie Boogie is what happens when, uh, when the whole thrill of scaring people goes a bit too far. What? Down. I forgot what direction I'm going. Oh, I'm falling for it again. Still don't have the that card yet. But I've got this one. But this has to be nine, doesn't it? Seven plus. Nope. Can I change? Change that, but not. That's not worth it. I'll just save the. I'll just save my points for the extra world. Alright. There we go. Alrighty. 30 green, and thankfully I've got a lot now. Okay. Maybe not as much as I thought. Nope, that's a nine. I'm starting to think there's no more heartless in this room. Oh. Oh, there's exactly one heartless left in this room. Only one. And there they went. Eight. Well, now I need six more after that. I may have to reshuffle the roulette room. Alright, this will give us rare cards. Unfortunately, it will also make the Heartless stronger. By adding plus two to their cards. the cards are kind of low anyway and you can't break they they can't break slights so I'm fine there we go. Oh. Oh, cool bottomless darkness Pumpkin head. Now I can heal in peace. Heal. Power. And go. Freeze. Eh, that was easy. Cool, a zero. Great. Yeah. Back. Nope. 
Moogle is not there anymore. Oh, Moogle shot. Six. Zantetsuke. Rank a card and render it unreloadable for the length of the battle. Not too useful, but you can make it by using either uh, three zeros or three nines. How far does this one have to go? Oh. This is the part I'm not a big fan of. Freeze. Freeze. Just grinding away for the right card. Just need another green. Oh, there's another area up there I can fight. We are. For his sake, I hope he has a green. Oh, that's a blue. It's a save. Random Joker? What does that mean? What it? What? Alright, that's not gonna help me now. That's not too helpful. Go green, finally. Oh my gosh. Okay. Random Joker is definitely going to be interesting. I've never seen that before, though. Just in case I'm going to save. I don't normally do it, but that was a lot of grinding, and I don't want to mess anything up. Do. Did I have that the whole time, or was I just dumb? Oogie, hand over the potion. You fools don't know when to say when to quit. Say, all this running around's making me thirsty. Oogie, no! Yogi, yes! One gulp. Oh no. Haha, <laughs> lip smacking good. Oh, what is this? Wait, something's wrong. Something deep inside me. Something's scary. Uh, what's going on? What's happening? Get back. Stay away from me. What? Alrighty, welcome to yet another Boogie Boogie gimmick fight. Nope. Nope. How you get to fight him this time is by card breaking him repeatedly. Nope.
Craig, there we are. This is it. Once his guard broken, just wail on him. Dang it. Seven. He broke. Now, his dice constantly use a seven, so you may want something higher than that. Just prepped and ready to go. There we go. He doesn't really defend himself too much. There we go. Nope. Boogie Boogie is honestly one of the easier fights. My card. Uh oh. Nope. That was a heal. He tried to do. You just get up there. And this should finish it. Oh, no, it's not. There we go. Huh. There he is. Now this bag of bugs to make themselves useful. And while I'm here. Found that oogie boogie. You drank nearly all of my precious potion. There are only a few drops left. Hey, Sor, why don't you ask the doc if you can drink the rest? No, I'd better not. What? You don't want it? Too bad. Would have been a great experiment. Now, doctor, would you want to find out about your true memories? Of course, now more than ever. But there's this guy, Axel. I promised him I'd find the truth on my own. Just understand. When I inhaled the potion, Heartless appeared. When Oogie drank it, he was overcome with fear. What could it mean? It means the potion was a failure. No, that can't be wrong. Oogie must have found his true memories. Ah. Uh. True memories must unbalance the heart and cause unpredictable changes within. Then, what about me? What happens when my true memories awaken? Perhaps something even more terrifying. But this is all just hypotheses. I can't be sure without further research. What's wrong, Sora? Does the doctor's theory scare you? Well, yeah, a little. That's good to hear. Fear and doubt are signs of a strong heart. They push your heart, strike out in new directions, take chances. Without them, your zest for life might fade. As would your taste for fear. And believe me, that would really ruin my fun. Thanks, Jack. I'll remember that. Then good luck, gentlemen. May you always enjoy being frightened. Huh. Guess it does allow a certain tension. Didn't quite think of it that way. Oh, hey, more Blizzard. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, honestly, that Oogie Boogie fight is kind of a pushover. Oh, one more. 
and I think I'm honestly kind of glad it was because of how, like, how long it took to get there. The cards uh, that the map desired were really demanding. Oh, now I can have more cards in the deck, though. Like another heal. Oh, yeah, Oogie Boogie. So, we got Oogie's card. When I say make himself useful, it regens you. It gradually will heal you. Very nice. Uh, this one, I glad I actually recommend. It's very nice. Uh, that should do it. I need a three. Eh, I can put a three. There we go. That should do it. All right, this is Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Re: Chain of Memories. I'm Luigi Man 64D. I'll see you next time.